Now, right now, we're waiting on uh, our car to come up, and here it comes. Let's see if we can win this guy, man. Let's see. We hustle daily. What's going on, Hustle Nation? Good morning, man. As you can see outside, I don't know if you can see, but man, it's raining like a mug outside, man. But you know what? It don't matter to the Hustle Nation. It don't matter to Big Play Ray. We still gonna get out and we still gonna get the job done. I know some of y'all be crying. Oh, it's raining. I don't wanna go outside today. <laughs> Stop crying, man. It don't matter. Rain, sleet, snow, don't matter. I'm still gonna get out and I'm still gonna hustle. You feel me? And I hope y'all doing the same, Hustle Nation. That's what this is about. We hustle daily. You already know, man. <clears throat> but um, if you haven't already, don't make sure you guys like, you comment, you subscribe to the channel, man. Join the Hustle Nation. You hit the notification bell, man. You know what I mean? You drop a like. I need y'all to do that for your boy, man. If y'all haven't done so already, you definitely subscribe to the channel. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what y'all be doing, y'all. Some of y'all don't even got no YouTube account. Why y'all ain't got no YouTube account yet? Just subscribe. Y'all just be getting online. <clears throat> getting online every day and just watching my videos. But you don't even want to subscribe, man. I'm telling you right now, you is not a part of the Hustle Nation if you haven't subscribed. I'm just gonna tell you, you is not a specific, you, you is not a uh, certified hustler. You're not getting your certificate in the mail. You ain't getting nothing from me. <clears throat> Zero. Huh. Nothing. But yeah, man, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. Y'all know I'm just fooling around. Make sure y'all follow your boy on the gram, though. WeHustleDaily.co. Make sure y'all haven't, I mean, y'all follow me if y'all haven't done so. And WHDAcademy.com, y'all already know. Don't go to no auction thinking you just going to listen. Please just don't go to the auction just because you see something that's under uh, the price that you may be looking online. So you may be one of them people where you looked online or something. You looked on, you know, Craigslist or something. And you see it, those cars normally going for a certain price. And then you try to go to the auction and you think because that car is like two, three thousand dollars cheaper that it's the better deal sometimes. But no. Sometimes it's two, three thousand dollars cheaper because that car is tore the hell up. You know what I'm saying? There's something wrong with that car and you don't even know it. But you don't know no better. You just go into the auction buying stuff. A lot of stuff is in the auction because that shit is messed up. You know what I'm saying? So make sure y'all go to whdacademy.com. Man, I got two packages on there for y'all. I got the full curriculum package where I'm showing y'all everything I know. And then I got the basic package where any, but either package though, you should, you're going to learn how to check out a car for sure, for sure. But uh, we on our way to IAA, man. Um, just don't end up on the side of the road like a lot of y'all be doing. You know what I'm saying? Don't come to me in person and be saying, oh, you told me I could go here. No, I told you to get whdacademy.com. That's what I told you. But because uh, it's a lot of that happening. I'm sorry. There's a lot of that happening. Y'all be tripping me out. But we on our way to IAA, man. We got this truck to look at. It is a nasty day outside. <clears throat> I need some water or something. It is a nasty day outside, man. So... Uh, I'm gonna look at this truck. It's a 20. It, they got a couple of trucks. Silverados, man. Um, a newer truck, 2015 truck. And this one got the V6. I'm actually looking for somebody a truck. Uh, so this one got the V6, the 43 2015 Silverado photo. I'm looking for a truck, y'all. It gotta be photo. It gotta be a newer uh, truck. You know what I mean? So I'm look, going to look for this. And uh, yeah, I'll show y'all what else they got. But that's what I really got my eyes on, man. Hopefully, it crank up and everything. Y'all know how the cars at IAA. Uh, at these auctions and you know all these auctions do man y'all know how i feel about that if you don't know how i feel about that you need to go to whdacademy.com but i'm gonna go and focus on this road this raining man i see y'all when we get there check it out they got the rari in this thing i don't know what they doing to it what kind of little knob is oh that's for the probably the window what year is this joint y'all uh oh nine maybe Seats look kind of cool. I got my umbrella up. Those seats look straight. Look good. Little switches right there. Let's go on the other side. Yeah, that joint hard. I don't think this one is for sale yet. I think they just like cleaning it, cleaning it, cleaning, cleaning it out. Got the Ferrari right there. Let me touch these seats. I like this seat. Ferrari. Show your heart. Ain't no key push to start or nothing like that. Y'all see it? Yeah. Uh, 
Oh man, little ash tree. Yep. Man. Ferrari. And they got this. Got the doors open in the in the room rover. Let me see. Is this motor in the front? Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, there you go. Oh no, the motor, yep, my motor in the front. Y'all see it. Y'all let me know what y'all think about the Ferrari, man. Just had to catch that on camera because um they got it right here. Oh, as a matter of fact. 2010 Ferrari California, that's what it is. Alright, let's get out this thing. Alright, y'all, we're gonna hop right into it, man. This is the truck that I was telling y'all about. Uh, 2015 Silverado 187 on the miles the four door joint looks good they got 5,000 bucks on it right now as soon as I come in here somebody already already was looking at it um nice truck man big big bear with me it's hard holding the camera and uh trying to record the small back door though oh, it's got the small back door small back seats damn they got has some hair in here from some type of animal so it needs to be cleaned up let's let this down one second so i can move around right here we can't leave our umbrella got the big lights on that joint just got the four three in there, like I told y'all. Let's see if I can get in this thing right here. So definitely needs to be cleaned up. One, oh, I'm about to say, where's the keys, man? Let that check engine light go off. Damn, check engine light is on, yo. It's not good. Damn, that's not good. So, but y'all see it though. It's so always gonna be something, right? So, what is that? We got the baby screen. They know they could have gave us gave me something bigger than this. That's ridiculous. It's not touch. Don't look like. This sucks. He was in the Dallas Fort Worth area. This John suck. They could have gave us something better than that, man. Come on. But that check engine light is on, man. I don't like that. Let's see what that motor looking like. Gotta see what it's for, though. Because again, I can't even do anything with it with the check engine light on, y'all. Oh, I like that. I think the little side. Oh, the little side didn't come on, but definitely gotta see why the check engine light is on, man. Let me put my hood on. Got that old Porsche right there, that red joint. It's the regular four six. They got a couple of these, but this is the one I really wanted to check out the most. Because this one got a clear title. Missing the battery yet. Well, four six. Yeah, let me see what this oh, battery right here. Let me see why this check engine light on, man. Cause uh, that is a big deal. That is a big deal. So let's see. Oh, and then I got a car I'm about to bid on, so I'm gonna have to uh, turn the camera off in a minute anyway and see if I can win this car. Let's put that joint over there so we won't lose it. All right, y'all, so let's put this joint in drive. Let's turn these flappers on so I can see. Let's move up real quick, hold on.
Oh, we are. Okay, let's see. There's a back. Oh, I do got a backup camera. It suck. But, I mean, it's small, but it do got one. That's what's up. It feel good, though. Feel solid. But, um... I'm gonna have to catch y'all in a minute, man. I got a bid on this car. Hopefully, I can win something, man. Uh, yeah, I know another Nissan Maxima, right? It's not the CVT transmission. It's the one y'all probably seen in a couple of videos ago. This this seems cool. I just gotta see why this check engine light on. So I'll be back with y'all in a minute. I'll let y'all know if I win this car. Yes or nay, yay or nay. And um, that's all. I'll be right back. All right, y'all, we was just in this freaking uh, Ford Taurus 2006 with 84,000 miles, but it is trash, though. You know, I just cranked it up and everything. So now, right now, we're waiting on uh, my car to come up, and here it comes. Let's see if we can win this guy, man. Let's see. Damn. Damn. I'm good, y'all. Hell no. Hells to the no. That's crazy. Time extended. Well, hell no. Sold. I bet it did sell. Man, see, that's why I don't even be tripping on these cars, man. This junk. Price is way too high, y'all. Ridiculous, man. But um, let me log out of that. Remove that off my list. I am straight. On to the next, on, on to the next one. That's what I was gonna sell it for around 25. They paid 21 or whatever the hell that was. If they paid that much, that's what they gonna pay out the door. Around 2,500. Taurus trash. Um, the Silverado over there got some codes, man. So you're gonna spend that much money. I don't think I wanna, you know, uh, mess with that. Especially if I can't pass emissions right off back to, to uh, get rid of it. If I'm gonna spend like, you know, whatever it is gonna cost eight, nine thousand dollars probably for that truck, maybe. You know, I'd rather rather for the truck to be already, you know, running and gunning. So that's not gonna be the case for that truck. So um unless it goes for a cheaper uh, you know, a way like a super cheap price. It got some type of fuel ratio code or something like that. Y'all know what that is, y'all let me know in the comments below. But let's see if I can find me another car. Alright, here go another truck. It's the uh this one is the V8. Oh, this one got the salvage title. That's why I didn't keep it on my list. But 2015 Silverado 109 on the miles. You see, this one got the black handles. But yeah, I took it off my list because of the um, salvage title. I don't got time for that. Be waiting for the title to come back and everything. And there's the damage. Oh, this is the one that's really, really damaged. There's one that's not as damaged as this one somewhere around here but yeah this one is pretty tore up the seats look better damn this door don't open there we go. seats look better in this one though 109 on the miles yeah the seats look better in this one same thing though same interior and everything door spoke it's kind of hard holding the umbrella and the camera at the same time but we don't make it do what it do is this on my list um oh okay that truck is on my list they got this they got this new setup going where they got cars everywhere man I can't believe that Maxima. What y'all think? Let me know in the comments below what y'all think about that Maxima that just happened, man. I think that was kind of uh, absurd. But yeah, this is an 07 with 125. On the miles, we're gonna see if this crank up. Man, they paying for these cars, boy. No power for it, so. 
We can't mess with it. If you don't know why, whdacademy.com. Um, let's go look at this truck. Oh, 2000 model. It's like we truck shopping today, huh? Let's see. 2000. I have to draw a bow tie. They put tape right there, really? Are you serious, bro? Bro. 280,000 miles on this. I can't believe they, they put tape right there. That's crazy. It's people wild. Oh, kind of tight right here. It's people wild, man. These people is wild. Oh, man. Let's see if I can put my umbrella right here to chill. 200,000 miles. Usually something like this would be filthy. You got power, though. Uh, can't mess with that ladies and gents damn look at that all right y'all we gotta walk around here some more see if we can find anything else man that truck that 2015 silverado really disappointed me man because uh i thought that was gonna be a nice find there's actually another one here somewhere but it's not as nice as that one i didn't believe so that's why I wanted to look at that one first. But it's all good, man. Here's something that is on my list, though. This um, G37. G37. It's got a salvage title, too, though. Um, 08, 183 on the miles. I believe this one is salvaged out because of theft, if I believe, if I'm correct. Let me set this right here. Let's go look back up at that damage, though. Yeah, I think this is theft, though. Yep, theft. But they did salvage it out. They ain't got really no money on it. Only $300 on it right now. Oh, I remember. Damn, they stripped this thing, man. They stripped it. No seats, no nothing. Airbags, no radio, no glove box. Guess they only left the engine and the training in here, huh? They just wanted the seats. I guess. I'm supposed to take the engine and trans, man. I thought. You gonna steal it, you gonna steal it. You know? They just gonna take the thing and go on seats. Unless the seat's worth money. It says they're running drive too. So um let me finish walking, man, and uh looking for some more cars. I really do not like this new setup they got, boy. The setup of how you freaking doing circles, man, just to look for one car. So we're gonna see if we can find something else still walking. I catch y'all in a second. All right, we got a couple of vehicles in the vicinity. First up, we got this 07 F4 F-150, 94,000 miles on this one. So, oh my God, this umbrella, bro. It's not raining that hard. I could have probably left the umbrella in the, in, the, in the car, but, you know. And this Ford is not on our list. Well, not on our list to vibe because customer wants a four door Come on, man. this one nice though but it ain't photo so i guess this the cloth 
this one seemed like he got more backspace room than the one with the four door dude. That Silverado over there. Yeah, man, this is the plain Jane one. It got the, uh, it don't even got power windows. But they crank right up. It do sound good, but I don't, that's. Man, after just seeing what they gonna pay, they pay for that Maxima. Shit. I know they gonna pay for that truck. I might as well just keep looking. We got this uh, big boy. I might be able to get something like this for cheap. <laughs> this big boy um, Ford F-150. Um, let's see what's the miles and the money they got on this one here. Uh, 1999 Ford F-150 and it has 255,000 miles on it. They ain't even got no money on it right now. This boy definitely got some type of, I think that's an aftermarket blue with that RS, RSX. 250,000 miles on it. Big boy tires that cost an arm and a leg to place. Looks like they was working a little bit. I doubt this old truck right here cranked up. Yeah, they definitely sprayed this joint. Damn, is that like in it? That's like pushed in right there, isn't it? Oh, this truck smell foul too. It smells foul. He said, wow, 94,000 miles. Acura, I'm not really a fan of the Acuras, but it's on my list to check out. They ain't got nothing in here, bro. Damn. The joints say sport on the bottom. They added that. They definitely added that little piece. Damn, they didn't. Oh, wow. They got power, though, so let's see. But they done ripped this thing. I don't even see the key in this thing. The little things on the floor. Where's the key? See the key in this joint. Nothing I can do it with it. Do with it with no key. Nothing I can do with it with no key. Hustle Nation, man. Yeah, I could have definitely left this umbrella in the car. Um, gotta walk over this mud. This water. Man, where the freak are the, they got this stuff just mixed all up, y'all. But all right, guess y'all don't want to see me really just walk the yard, so I'll catch y'all when I uh find another car. All right. Ugh. This is another one. This is the other truck I was talking about. I think this one's different, though. This is, a... no, I don't know. This one just look more aggressive. I know it got the black wheels. Um, this is a 2016 though, so it's got to be probably the same. 135 on the miles on this one. This is the V8, and this is a salvage title. I don't remember the reason though. The body looks all right. Let's see if I can leave this. Oh shoot, I would have set that right there. My umbrella would have just blew, blew away just there. Let's see. And this one don't got the big mirrors in there. This one got leather though. Yeah, this one got the leather, homie. Big screen, bigger. Well, no, I think that's the same screen. Get my umbrella, I'm trying to get away. Where you going? Stay right there. Damn, that's what sound. This one ain't got the uh This one sound quiet. I thought this was the V8. This one sound way quieter than that V6. Damn, 
damn, I'll keep the V6 sound. Back. This, this boy quiet. Yeah, this the V the V8. Yeah, this boy way quieter than that V6 over there. For sure. We're gonna see what this go for though. Salvage title. I know I don't like buying salvage because wait so long on the damn title what is that he spilt something in here that little that, that uh white stuff have to probably get that up yeah man but all right y'all no playing around i think i gotta show y'all this maserati and uh yeah let's see if i can find something else all right we got two more these little cheap cars. Oh, and that uh, Silverado, it wasn't a salvage title. That last one we just seen with the black wheels, it was actually a clear title. So we got these two though to look at. But they got, they had eight, they got $8,000 on the, <laughs> that's a, a Boeing Arrow, that's the antenna. They got $8,000 on the, um... oh no, ugh. Oh man. Dang, people should be ashamed of their selves, guys. It's ridiculous, man. I don't put this in my car either. These don't ever got power to blazers. Yeah, but, uh, yeah, so they got uh, 8,000 bucks on it as of right now. That was a 2016 V8 with the 135 on the miles. Um, already a grand. I mean, not saying that this, that's not worth it. I'm just, you know already eight grand so y'all let me know what y'all think though what would y'all pay for that one that last one that we've seen i'm just so mad about my first one man the v6 because i knew i could probably like get it cheaper because it was the v6 that's why i was kind of like really banking on that one when i came but he got a cold and it, the motor don't even sound that good like the uh like that v8 do like that v8 sound way better to me at least but um, let me show y'all this Maserati then. I'm gonna go ahead and get up out this thing. All right, last but not least, we got your 2002 Maserati M128 Spider. I think that's what it is. 2002 Maserati, convertible baby. Convertible baby. Y'all see it, man. Let's check the inside out on this thing. If you wanna buy this right now, it's gonna cost you 95, honey. 95, honey. Hold up. Oh, this umbrella right here is like the most annoying thing. Is this car making noise? That the, the, um, what you call it? The, um, that's like burgundy type. Don't look better than that Ferrari. That Ferrari 2010, baby. This only a, uh, 02. Y'all see it though. It's kind of plain, Jane. They got paddle shifters. Is that say the trunk right there, or that say the hood? Let's see something. Lock this door. Lock those doors. They go right up. Let's see. Y'all see the little badge? Come on, man, my fingers. Damn. Oh, I see it. How the heck do I get my finger in there? Wow, that's tight. Y'all see it, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So big boy V8 in the convertible, man. This boy look like it barely fit in here. Maybe just because of the little side spots right here. But what y'all think, man? Y'all think it's worth 9,500 for the O2 Maserati? Let me know in the comments below. I don't see this on the street at all, though. And all right, Hustle Nation, just like that, man, I'm gonna go on and wrap it up for this video, man. Um, that truck really disappointed me. Didn't find none that I like today. And they really disappointed me on that that um, Nissan Maxima that they spent, like, damn, y'all spent 2,500. I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments below. It was an 01 with 110 on the miles. Y'all let me know what y'all think. I think that was kind of hot, but that's just me. 
But um, yeah, man, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, man. Make sure y'all hit the notification bell, man. Make sure y'all go to whdacademy.com if y'all don't want no lemon. You know what I'm saying? If y'all don't want to be on the side of the road, if y'all want to learn how to make money, buy and sell cars, don't put no money in them. Or if you want to learn how to just not get got, you know what I'm saying? Or if you're trying to buy a car off offline or on Craigslist or on Facebook Marketplace, whatever the case may be, man, whdacademy.com. I'm going to show you everything I know. You know what I mean? Big Play Ray, I don't buy lemons. I don't buy messed up cars. You know what I'm saying? So make sure y'all check out the website. But I'm, it's going to be a wrap for today's video. It's your boy Ray. Big Play Ray, I'm gone. Peace.